So, <clears throat> Mr. Gay, um, you're a flight attendant. Bingo. <clears throat> and uh, you want us to publish your book? Yetzi. Oh, but the book is not written yet. Twister. Uh, and it is the story of your life. It's called Larry Gay, the unauthorized autobiography. The unauthorized autobiography? Um, but an autobiography cannot be unauthorized. Or can it? By writing the book, you're implicitly authorizing that it be written. Define implicitly. Mr. K, was there ever a time in the past that maybe I'm unaware of where I wiped my bottom with 20 minutes of your life? Define aware and 20. Who arranged this meeting? Uh, <clears throat> I, I did, sir. You're fired. And happy birthday. Hey. Now, would someone please show this jackass the door? I already saw the door on my way in. Now, sir, my life story yearns to be told. It's a tale of intrigue, adventure, and life among the clouds. Mr. Gay, if you held a gun to my head and said to me, hey, be less interested in my book, or I will splatter the walls with the contents of your skull, I don't think I could. I guess I'll just have to take my story elsewhere. That's right. There are other fish in the publishing sea, my friend. Yes, in Manhattan, I'm gonna need two numbers. The first one is for Simon, and then I need one for Schuster. <sighs> Look, if I walk out that door, guys, I'm not coming back. You got it? Oh, you think I'm bluffing? You think I'm bluffing? Good day, everyone. Okay. I'm headed to the elevator. Do we have any kind of screening process here? Okay, I'm in the elevator. Get out. Yep. Yes. It's closing. The door's closing. The door's closing. Last chance! If I get in a taxi, you're out of luck! Yeah.